What's up, Hall of Famers? Card Shop Eric here, back at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California. Our brick and mortar is finally back open, and we got some new amenities. Carpet, a new bar, a bunch of fun stuff. We're gonna give you the full shop tour right now. Follow me. All right, Hall of Fame Baseball Cards, Arcadia, California, 319 East Foothill Boulevard. Come on in with us. The first thing you're gonna notice is Yama, the oh, Yama man. 3000. What's up, Yama? How you doing, buddy? Alright, man. How are you? Welcome doing to... well. Well, welcome to the new shop. What We've do you been guys working think? hard, haven't we? So hard. I hope you guys enjoy it. For the, some of the people that come and visit our shop regularly, you might notice the biggest change, brand new carpet. Look at that. Brand new carpet. We finally put in new carpet after over 30 years of rocking the same carpet. So our shop is not the biggest, but as you can see, it's wall-to-wall -wall cards right here, folks. Wall-to-wall, -wall. and the whole front of the shop is baseball cards. You got a whole wall of vintage cards over here, and then when you turn around to your right as you come in the door, all the current products are over here, and we got singles down here. We got a nice place to uh, sit down here at the front. If you move on here, we got some football and basketball cards right here, and then one of the biggest things that we did we used to have all of our basketball cards here in a case kind of like one of these, but we got rid of the case, we got rid of the shelves, and look what's in its place. A flat screen TV and a brand new bar that who built? You and I. That's right. That's right. And CJ helped too. CJ. CJ. Yeah. Thanks, CJ. And so we uh, hand built this little bar for people to sit at while they're uh, ripping cards. Um, here's our counter over here with our cash register. We got some autograph memorabilia. Uh, we got a little vintage uh, singles lots up here for anyone looking for vintage. We got all your accessory needs right here. Uh, the whole back of the shop, uh, we turned into a little wraparound sit-down bar area as well. So we got a lot more room in here for everybody who comes to visit. Um, there's a lot more room. You guys might think it's small, but I'm telling you, it's a huge improvement from where it was. Maybe I'll try to sneak in some old photos. Uh, but let's go back here. This used to be our office. Uh, here's back, by the way, a 1981 Donruss uncut sheet. Who's got best mustache on here? Can you find one with the best mustache? I was looking at some of them earlier. Like, how about Scott Thompson right there? He's got a pretty good stash. Anyways. This used to be our office, and our break room used to be right here. Literally, right on this wall was our media cabinet where we were doing our live breaks. But now there's our media cabinet right there. And this is our new break room. It used to be our office. We got a full size fridge in here finally. And there's the media cabinet where we do all of our personal breaks and all of our live streams right here. And then uh, you gotta go back, you turn around, it's a long place. We got the bathroom all nice and cleaned up back here. And then uh, here's the office. Yama, come and uh, show off your, your office right here. This is Yama's new office right here. We got some new carpet, we got nice chairs, a new desk here. This used to be our jam room, don't tell anybody, but yes, we used to play music here. But what do we got going on here now, Yama? You happy with this setup? I'm super happy with this setup. I Enable me to process your orders a lot faster. That's right, the Yama 3000 working overtime. We got uh, all sorts of cool stuff. You can see some of the foam insulation on the walls from our jam space. Um, you can still see some uh, PA speakers, a nice bass amp with a guitar. We got the drum set and the uh, Marshall right here with a little guitar case. We will still jam back here on occasion if we get desperate enough, and I'm sure that will happen. Here's some, what, 1984 tops right there, I believe. And uh, this is all behind the private glass. I forgot to show off the private glass. And then we got some storage space back here, which you guys don't really need to see all that. That's just that's just product that nobody can afford right now, isn't it? It is. Well, that's it. That is the shop. A quick look. Oh, I forgot about Jordan. That's one of the original Jordan uh, soaring right there, wings that my dad laminated from back in the day. We hung that up there. But that's basically the shop. That's all we got. We've been here for 30 years. We've been in business for 40 years. And uh, we're ready for the new generation of Hall of Fame baseball cards in Arcadia, California. What do you guys think? So there you go, a quick tour of the new and improved card shop. No, not me, the actual card shop. Uh, thanks to Yama for joining us on this tour. Comment down below, what do you guys think of the new and improved shop? And uh, have you visited us before? 
Do you want to come visit? Tell us uh, all about yourselves in the comments right now. Hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and come visit us. Hall of Fame Baseball Cards or HOFBC.com in Arcadia, California. We would love to see you guys. Remember, of course, during these times, practice your social distancing. Make sure you're clean. Wear your mask. All that good stuff. Let's get back to normal here, folks, very soon. We love you guys. We look forward to seeing everybody soon, whether in store or live on personal breaks. And until then, I guess we sign off. How do we sign off? Peace. Peace.